today we're going to bring you a video as far as my dad's strawberries. Uh, they are not doing good this year. Uh, they do have a disease. Uh, it's a very rare disease and we just found this out yesterday. So I wanted to make a video to show people out there if this happens to your berries. It's nothing that you have done. It's just something that comes from the nursery and it's actually very devastating. Uh, the strawberries, uh, they don't know whether they want to be a berry or a flower. Of all the years that my father has done uh, strawberry fields, we have never seen this. Uh, they did get some samples and they're going to be taking and sending those off to confirm. Um, I cannot remember exactly uh, what they called um, the disease. It doesn't hurt anybody. You can still eat the berries that are good, um, but it causes the plants to die and we will find some berries to show you exactly what to look for and it possibly if you ever see this on your berries it possibly could be the same thing uh, Clemson uh, came out and they go over our berries all the time they help us with different things as far as our berries and he was the one that uh, found this and he said that he has not seen this before <laughs> and uh, it's it's just that rare so come along and we're going to show you what the strawberry field looks like. Right here you can see that each one of these, uh, these are the berry bushes. These are the ones that survived. But if you go down a little bit, you can see where all the bushes have died. Each one of these holes were a strawberry plant and they have just died. Um, the field was just covered. They were beautiful and it happened very quickly. Um, if you can look right here, this is an example right here. This is a strawberry, but you cannot tell it is a strawberry. It looks like it's trying to become a flower. If you look right here, it's not all of them, but uh, right here, the same thing is happening. You can see right here where the little seeds are, and it looks like it's trying to flower out right here. Right here, the same thing. The little seeds it, it it's got too much of the little seeds that are trying to flower out it's a devastating devastating to my father's crop All right, let's come this way and we're gonna show you a few rows that doesn't have uh, as much disease on it. So right through here, you can see that the bushes are fuller. Um, they have a lot more berries on them. You can look here. What's that going? You can hear it. The, the berries are beautiful. But they're still not producing like they should. And then you can look on this side of the field. And it's just terrible. It's just thousands and thousands and thousands of dollars lost here. It's a very sad situation. But you can look right here, the bushes, they're just dying. And all of these just have disease. Now the ripe berries that we have right here, um, 
they're they're edible it doesn't hurt it doesn't hurt the public or anything like that so when people come out to pick berries it's perfectly safe uh, this particular disease pretty much just ruins your strawberry crop uh, it causes the plants to die and also the berries to turn in what looks like they're trying to become a flower usually you get about a quart per bush uh, this year we will not see those numbers at all um, but we'll wait for uh, when they come back with all the test results to confirm whether it's this or not and I will definitely let everyone know I hope out there that a lot of people haven't had this disease or if they've seen it before you know leave a comment down below on how they got through this it is it is a very devastating um, thing that's happened uh, to my dad so anyway I did want to make a video uh, to show you uh, how our strawberry crop was doing this year and the disease that they have seen in our berries and because it's so rare just to have something out there um, I hope you enjoy this video until next time you'll have a wonderful day Bye.